trees are somehow part of childhood, aren't they? Climbing trees is a, is a fundamental instinct. I think it probably goes back to the very uh, sources of human nature, uh, the, the relationship with man and trees. One of my earliest memories, I, I used to have this tree, I used to got to the top and I made a little platform at the top. And I used to go up there and read. Nobody could find me or get to me. They couldn't be seen from the below. That um, was a really something, a really sacred place to me. With Dad and his adventurous nature of all the very difficult films that he's done, you know, that has certainly set me up for what I do now, you know. And, and it was all, I think, the inspiration really in that, that wanderlust and that, that sense of adventure. When I was preparing Emerald Forest and I went, travelled through the Amazon rainforest, I, of course, began to experience the rainforest. And I realised just how majestic and extraordinary they were. And then also the vast tracts that were being cut down. You know, I, it, the cause was very close to me. I don't think I was about 17 when we went and did the Elmer Forest together. It was a real eye-opener for me. And back in 1984, it was the first time that people sat down in the cinema and actually saw what was actually happening in the jungle. I always find that if you've got a camera in a forest, you put the camera down anywhere and you've got a shot. If your local wood is, inspires you, it's never been easier to go in with a smartphone these days. You know, the access is unbelievable. You know, you sit there and you put a good little clip on. Before you know it, you could have 100,000, 200,000 people watching that clip. If you can get something on it, people will watch it.